edition of the T on the TLIG revision, we bring your brand to the world stable. If there's anything you're doing and you want people to know about it, you want to have you know clients from across the globe. This is the program to be on. Okay, today I have a wonderful guest in the house. She is Reverend Oluwa Toin Jayola, and she is the CEO of the Health Factory. Yes. Good afternoon, man. Good afternoon. How are you doing? I'm fine. Good to have you on the show. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks for having me. You look lovely. Thank you. Like you. Uh, <laughs> you <looking good. laughs> Thank you, mommy. <laughs> All right. So we're just going to go into today's topic, which is the importance of herbal medicine in Africa. But before we go into that, answer, you know, before she talks about that. So mom, tell us about the health factory itself. Um, the health factory is actually a herbal supplement shop. Okay. Uh, we are into premium herbals, which we produce by ourselves. Okay. Um, we have drug, we, 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 we actually manufacture different things for health maintenance, okay. uh, preventive, okay. and um, for sustenance of the organs in the, body. in the body. You know, that's what herbal medicine is actually all about. And it's, it's holistic. Takes care of the entire system. It takes care of the entire system. Okay. That's what um, we have a factory for. So how how did it how did it start? Like the the whole health factory. How did it start? Is this something you just woke up and said, "Oh, I feel like going into herbal"? You are a reverend. Yes, I am. Exactly. So how did it start? How did you think of doing this in the first place? Very interesting. I've been that for I've been in ministry for years, okay. and there's been. But I also do business. Okay. Like um, I have a, um, I used to have a market where people bring things to sell. Um, sometime ago, then I have um, a, a shop where we sell. Where we, where we actually um, sell. Um, processing equipment. Absolutely, you know, so. Sometimes in 2020, I um, had a problem. I started having a burning sensation in my stomach. And I went to the doctor and he said, do you have ulcer? And I said, ulcer, mm, I'm a pastor. How can I have ulcer? Can you imagine? Mm. Like, How no. can I have ulcer? And he's like, okay, go and do a test. I went to do a test and truly I had ulcer. And I was like, wow. And it was bad. For months, I couldn't sleep. It was the really bad. On the morning. It was terrible. So he gave me some drugs. Then a few months later, something happened. I woke up with a saddle. And I was like, oh, what was that? It was, something happened that night. I couldn't understand it. So my husband called the doctor in the middle of the night. Well, he said, okay, when you wake up tomorrow, go and do your cholesterol. So I went to do that. And they said it was high. And I was like, really? Cholesterol? Oh, who, who thinks about who cholesterol? Thinks about cholesterol? Going, going high or going low? You know, who thinks about <laughs> it, you know? And then after that, he gave me some drugs. And for three months, I was paying like, I was buying like about 40,000 worth of drugs. That is it didn't work for me. I don't know why. It just didn't work. So I decided, okay, let me go have one. And I, do, I did that in three, in less than three weeks. I brought it up. We have us. But I didn't even think about it. Um, 2020 ending, and God said, drop everything you're doing. Don't do ministry. Any, everything, just drop it. I was a bit surprised. Why would God be telling me to, to drop, drop everything? everything? I was really scared. I said, I was going on here. So I dropped everything. I was even about to start my entrepreneurship um, marketplace ministry. He said, drop it. So I dropped it. And I was waiting. January, he said, go into Harbour Medicine. He gave me the name. He was the one that actually he gave me the, the health name. factory. Wow. Yes. He actually gave me such the health details. factory. Yes, such details. And I was like, really? Health factory? Me? From <laughs> where? <laughs> how would people receive it? I mean, even me, how do I receive You're still it? In shock. I'm still in shock. You know, that kind of thing. Uh, but because I knew that um, when he gives instructions like that, there's a reason. So we started work. It took, it took a lot of research. A lot of research. Um, for one year, we've been working, we've been working, we've had, we now have farms that are supplying us. Absolutely. Uh, yes, we do our production by ourselves to make sure that the quality is sound. We do the production, we do the um, um, the packaging, okay. and everything. So um, that was basically how 
we started the, the whole thing health factory that is amazing so what products do you produce and what do they cure wow mm -hmm. we we now for that uh, one year we we now have like about 20 something products 20 it's something a two kilo i haven't had a rest in one year because i just hit the ground running and we've done a lot of work uh we have quite a bit the, the first one that god gave us was an oil exactly that's the one i want you to talk about oh, the mint olive yes it's called the mint olive relief. reliever yes or something it's like called that. the mint olive oil actually it's for pain no matter where you have the pain on your body, whether the back pain, your shoulder pain, Waist even pain. breast pain, yeah. even breast pain, your shoulder pain, your leg pain, your ligament pain, and then sciatica pain, whatever it is, just massage it. With the I'm, oil. I'm telling you, in five minutes, that in five amazing. minutes, five you begin to feel the Relief. pain you go down. You feel relieved. I'm telling you, in fact, uh, my husband, used it one as he said wow this is a jebidon you know and for everybody that sent us um, um reviews, the reviews yeah. and everything they use only one word and the word keeps on recurring it's like magic whether they were elderly there's an elderly man and woman in their 80s i guess is their um their niece calls from america for us to send it to them okay. this man wakes up at 5 a.m and start praying and praying and praying wow, and it takes you like oh my god <laughs> you know so the oil is awesome you don't need to be popping panadol all the time and everything Taking drugs oh this is this is good we have another oil called um black leaf oil okay, what does black leaf do? oil is like um um total organ uh tonic Okay. It reduces your cholesterol. It works on your liver. It works on ulcer. It works total organ tonic. It's also anti-cancer. Okay, how often do you need to take this? You just need to take it once a day. Just a spoon when you're sleeping, you're, you're about to sleep or first thing in the morning on an empty stomach. You know, one of the things we need to learn in this time is um, to be preventing Exactly. You know, you don't I, wait until something goes wrong. Let me come from the Christian uh, angle. You know, you get to church and give a testimony. Oh, I had uh, this, that, that, that they hung my leg for two weeks. Praise yeah. the Lord. Hallelujah. God doesn't need that kind of testimony all the time. The, one of the best testimonies is, oh, God has kept me clean for the past one year, and God has been it because I also do some things we, we, we need to watch our lifestyles we need to watch what we take we need to watch so many things some people don't drink water and dehydration alone is one of the most the biggest problems that people have because it causes a lot of organ damage just dehydration just the fact that you don't take enough just the water fact that you don't take when you're tasty, water. you rather take carbonated drinks instead yes, of water. yeah and that damages so much you know then we have um we have a, pep a peppermint uh, mix we call it a blend it reduces anxiety and stress i remember there was a lady that came to my office she was so stressed up she had gone through so much in a short while and um she sat down and i said please can you just do me tea and give it to her she took the uh, tea while in your office while in my office in five minutes she was like please can i sleep on the floor i said ah you can't do you know, they, you know? <laughs> We didn't work so it's fast. Like, honestly, it's like, I, I, like, it's as if it just drained the stress out of me, you Take know? the problem. Yes. So, I, and it's so awesome. That is also so awesome. We have uh, this mental alertness. Okay. It's good for... The one you just talked about. This, this is the stress. one. This, yes. Okay. This, this is, is the peppermint. One. Yes. It's really nice. Um, This is a mental alertness. In fact, there's a wonderful testimony that was sent to us. For I, mental I, yes, alertness. For mental alertness. It helps you... Uh, you know, a lot of us are celebrate what we do where you're calculating, you're reading, yeah, you're working. You do so and much mental work. Yes, we need sometimes to just cool it down, to just maintain your 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 brain. And these are the things that help. Even for headache, it helps with headache also. To relieve headache. It helps to relieve headache. And then you have this. Um, it's a tea. We call it total wellness. Total wellness. This is like total body tonic. Mm -hmm. So it's like they have... The, uh, tea this is a tea for the, and that's the oil. Yes, that's the oil okay. for you know. So this works really good. And uh, we have some, you know, we have some people want to lose weight. Yes, most people. Want and to they keep on. Them. They are hungry. You know, this helps. How does it help? It just you take it and you you don't feel hungry. 
you just take train the money and you don't feel it takes hungry. away that urge of wanting to eat all the, craving, time. Craving for food yeah. all the time so you can now use that to start managing mm -hmm. your diet yes yeah. your food portion and all of that so it helps you to control what you're eating because this you are nice. not so hungry this is really nice this is really, really nice. nice we have uh, the detox you see the food we're eating most of the nutrients are not there anymore because of the way they're grown on the, in the ground. Okay. Um, there are so many, all kinds of minerals in the ground that come into the food and they become to toxic in our body. Mm. Yes, then, you know, your the environmental toxic, okay. you have uh, environmental uh, toxic. toxic, toxics. And um, um, we have from food, we don't take, if, you, if you're if you dieting, you're not taking in enough nutrients. Absolutely true. Yes, then there's so many people who say, oh, they just want, um, I don't know. They just take bits and bits and all of that. Yeah. They don't take it's it more, complete. More, more. Yes, they don't even have a, a balanced diet. diet. Your well, balanced okay. diet is carbs, protein, uh, liquid fats, and all, all of must that. Be present. All should be present. But we don't take all of that. We probably just take one. So we have a lot of uh, nutrients that are missing in our system. So sometimes we just need to take some of this to, um, balance, to balance them. So, um, for okay. Some people don't sleep. Okay, for me, um, I got my, my schedule. If I skip that schedule, maybe I don't sleep at the, that particular that time. time. My eyes are open for hours. So you I must can't miss it. So I, I try not to miss that, that time, time because then. I just won't be able to sleep anymore. This is good. This gives you deep sleep. It's not, and you know, all the things are quite um, health, healthy. Because there are no side effects. Mm, I was going to or ask the you side, that. They are all herbal. Yeah, they are all herbal. The side effects are so many. Uh, that's if they have any. Some of them don't not don't have any side they're effects. Because they, no, they, no, 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 they have us. They're crude herbs. No additives. No coloring. No flavors. No nothing. No preservatives. No preservatives. Nothing. They're quite natural. And then what we do is that we, most times we don't just do tea where you have in powder form and all of them. No, we do infusions. And what that means is you when you take the tea, you put it in water, you let it sit for about 10, between 5 and 10 minutes. Okay. So everything in the leaves comes out. Wow. And then you drink it. Nothing is remaining Normally, in the leaves. Normally, yes. And then you drink it. So you have all the nutrients Complete. in your body. Yes, when, some for flower, uh, when you take the powder ones uh you just take it as this so there's no infusion yeah, of the nothing is really, everything comes inside no no what i'm saying is the, the leaves when you infuse them you actually you're able to sip out all the nutrients already the yes but with the powder most of we just take them as tea just pour water and immediately Directly. you're drinking it but this one gives you draws out whatever is in the leaf already and it's yes this yes and we don't, um, we do not address that people should use maybe sweetness because okay. yes. So when you want to take any of these herbal products, you're not supposed to use any sweetener. No, really. Just, mm -hmm. just take, because they're really tasteless, really. So just take it with maybe lemon or okay. ginger okay. Uh -huh. that, that, that helps better. Sweeteners like honey, maybe if you must, if you but want, really because honey say, is also organic. Yes. Really we say no, we have, um, we have, uh, what do you call it now, bitter leaf as capsules. Really? We have ugu as capsules. So, so many people that can't even take bitter leaf because it's bitter. And then, you know, a lot of um, the people from the East, they use bitter leaf a lot. Yes. But they by the time they use it, they're taking out all the active ingredients in it. Is it's the, it's the bitterness that actually makes it work like that. Did you hear that? So when you remove all the bitter, you're just eating shaft. <laughs> nothing, <laughs> nothing. So what we have done is we have encapsulated uh, bitter leaves. So you can actually take it as capsule. And it works in your system. And it works in your system because it helps with the bile, works with the liver and all of that. It works with that. We have um, uh, blood pressure, uh, capsules we have for alzheimer tea for the brain wow. you know when you start forgetting things and all of that suddenly yes we have we it have can be treated no it can you can you can delay that you can it can actually be we have for heart support we have the whole case and you know women a lot of women they have uh, menstrual pains yeah oh and it could be bad it could really be bad and then some who are on menopause 
th those menopause issues are, could be very, very depressing at times. You have flushes where you're just sitting down and all of a sudden, you know, you just go from one, um, you're, you're, you're looking nice now. The next thing is I said, they poured water all over your body and you're in one second and you're wondering if you're looking at the person you're like, oh, where did water come from? Mm. You know, sometimes you can't sleep. It just messes up your emotion. We have we have um, capsules for the menstrual pain. We have for the um, to help with the menopause. We have um, anxiety. Like I said, we have anxiety ones. We have pain away. There's what we call pain away. For people who have arthritis, okay, you just Joints, take it. Pains and all and you just take it and honestly. It's, it, by the time you wake up, you're feeling so light, and you're like, okay, did I have this pain? Did I have this pain, you know. You can't even find the pain. <laughs> you anymore. can't even find the pain. Uh, we have a, uh, a green, you know, green tea. We have a blend of green tea. It melts the the fat in your stomach. stomach okay. Yes, you actually lose weight by taking some of this. So, like the detox, I'm saying we should detox at least once a month. Wow. Yes, because anybody, just, everybody, whether just, man or woman, whether man or woman, just um, you know, I you have detox uh, monthly. Yes, I have a uh, DPO who is uh, one of my customers. Last week he took one of the detox on, and I was monitoring him. Oh God, have you taken it and all of that? Because by the time you're doing the detox, you don't eat all the above. Um, oh, you know, okay. you just go you light. Cut down. You cut down. You just go light on maybe uh, smoothies and all of it, so that mm. it's not the system is not getting clogged up as you are cleansing it if you're not plugging it up again and all of that so we have quite a lot for different things that um different systems different organs different challenges, support, yeah. and different challenges oh, yeah. that is amazing you have so many good products. yes we do as a matter of if i'm asked to buy i'll just order for everything you don't need to buy one <laughs> <laughs> well we actually have a the one people order they out there quite a bit. This morning we've sent some to US already. Yes, we've sent amazing. some to US. Already. Okay, um, you know, generally, you know, when it comes to herbal products and all, um, people are skeptical. Why do you think so? Like people, when people hear herbal, they might just think it's related to something fetish. Yeah, you know, people like that. So why do you think people think people okay. have that mindset? Okay, let me tell you what happened. A few years ago, when I say a few years, like our grandfather, our grandmother. Oh, okay, okay. Before the uh, um, the missionaries came to Nigeria, they were the herbalists. But unfortunately, they were not just herbalists. Okay. They were native doctors. They were herbalists. They were um, all kind of things. Which some of them are even yeah, witch yeah. you know, know about witchcraft. They practice witchcraft. They're warlords and all of that. But sorcery. they are the ones sorcery and all of that. But they were the ones that were healing. Okay, True. but funnily enough, apart from that, there are some that are strictly herbalists. What they do is just to work with herbs. They have a knowledge of okay. herbs. Okay, so by the time the missionaries came, they told them to stop because of okay, the incantations oh, and all of yeah, that. The fetish oh, they, part. The fetish part. So yes. they, they thought both of them were mixed together. So they now told them to stop. In stopping, it has rubbed off of so many things. And then because of Western education and uh, all the sophistication and all of that, we think that what we have is actually inferior to what, to we are being what given. we're being given from the Western world. But the truth of the matter is that there are people in the Western world right now, they will not go into pharmaceuticals to buy things because they prefer the yes. alternative, they prefer the have. So because of that background, a lot of people, because, oh, you said somebody doing incantations. Mm, that is the that. initial mindset. That was the so initial what they hear mind, about. That, they, just they just think, think oh, it's one to man. Blah, 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 blah. Yes, that is doing something. But unfortunately, um, over the years, things have changed. And then, you know, so those people know things that they might not know it by, um, they might not be able to tell you that this is how I know it. Exactly. But the truth of the matter is they know that these herbs can do this. They're okay. very sure. They're very sure. Okay, let me give you an example. You'll think it is. If your, your grandfather comes to you and he says, um, you're like, Daddy, where are you going? Oh, I'm going to the farm. At 4 a.m. in the morning, say, yes, I need to pluck some leaves before morning. And you're wondering that, uh, why? You exactly. know? Exactly. You could have just waited. Why you could just have waited. No, he couldn't have waited. 
And so you think that's probably fetish. Mm -hmm. He couldn't have waited. You know why? That particular plant that he wants to pluck has essential oils, volatile oil. Ooh. The minute the sun, sun comes, comes up, out, it is gone. And that is the active ingredient in that in particular that plant. plant. So we look at it like, ah, this man decided again, like, can you imagine it's going not, to the farm at this point? Like, so it's we not think fetish. that all of that was fetish, mm -hmm. but no. And then um, a lot of people who are now who now have access to herbs now think that not one, they, they don't know dosage, they don't know toxicity and all of that. They do not know um, how it works. Okay. But you see, over the years, um, research had, has gone much more further than what our it fathers used to, used to be. Right now, I can tell you this dosage of what this, the tea here, it has a specific dosage. And it has, uh, uh, we tell you, you can take it two times in a day, three times in a day. Right. Before I give it to you, I'm going to ask you some questions because actually um, herbal medicine is actually holistic. So it's not like... It takes care of the whole body. It takes out the whole body. And they do know that some of the uh, uh, pharmaceuticals you take actually come from herbs. Yes. For example, um, aspirin comes from herbs oh yes it comes from a particular plant they just uh, synthesized that particular nutrient on it and turned it into aspirin and the herb is there and when you take the herb it does more than what aspirin Direct. does so you can see that everybody is actually taking herbs true but you just don't think of it like you know yeah. what to, okay look at covid when covid came your bold um uh what do you call it your bold uh, ginger and this and that, garlic. and garlic. Hey, that is herb. herb. That is a herbal medicine. Absolutely. Yes. Absolutely. <laughs> so this was what created the impression that made people skeptical about yes. herbal medicine. Yes. Okay. So, like I said earlier, you're a reverend. Can a Christian use herbal medicine? Oh yes, a Christian can use herbal medicine. Um, if you look at um, Revelation twenty-two, okay. God said twenty-two two. God said. Um, this tree brings out fruits every month and the fruit itself is for meat uh, but the leaves is for healing of nations wow. and then in ezekiel 47 it says to you that this tree brings out meat as it's the meat the, uh, the tree is meat but the leaves is for medicine it says it exactly the that. scriptural. So it's scriptural. So both ways you can see that, you know, God is for him to tell me to go into it. I mean, it's very scriptural. And we are the one missing out because what he has given to us, other people are, are using, using it. it. It's a and gift. we're saying, well, Christian, mm, we can't use it. Can't so touch it because it's actually, Yes. And that's quite wrong. Very that's wrong. quite wrong. Okay, before we come to the end of the show, I would like you to tell us how we can get this product, how available are they? Oh, okay, they're quite available. Um, right now, we, we sell online. Okay. Okay, and some people can come to our office where they want it. We, we, we ship to UK, we ship to US, we do cargo okay. uh, to the people that want it. Do you also sell and, in bulk? Oh, yes, for people who want to buy in bulk. Okay. We sell in bulk. Is um, do I give the address? Of the yes, you can oh, give okay. the address. You should. Oh, okay. Um, if you need to buy any of our products or you have an issue you just want to discuss with them because we know that a so lot of people, people have issues. Yes, yeah. yes. You have quite a number of issues and you just want to talk and um, you just want somebody to, to just talk to you about what the issues might be. Please call um, um, 090. Okay, nine. 0909. Yes, 00000254. Very easy. 00000254. Yes. And we're at 221 B. Herbert McCauley. Okay. And um, we, we actually try to, um, to talk to people. For example, anxiety, depression. There are things you can take that can actually, actually yes, take that, that, can actually reduce take the that, effects. that mode. Yes, it actually helps you. Because cope. some people actually think things like that do not have solutions. No, they have. They have. They actually have. Okay. All right. All right. 
Okay. Um, do you have, if I want to order online, is there any way to order online? Oh, they can call the, they can the actually number call the number. Well. Yes. Do you have any social media accounts? Oh, yes, we have the health factory. The we health have factory. Instagram. Yes. Okay, we have Instagram. Our Instagram and Facebook. Um, on our Facebook, we have the health factory on the farmers delight because that's the uh, mother um, company. company, you know, so they can actually call. We can supply them anytime. They can come to the office. They can order even on the Facebook, or on the social handles. Okay. So um, before we go, I would just like to know, how do you source for your materials? Do oh. you grow them or you oh, yes. buy them? Some of them we grow. We have our, our teas. We, we grow quite a bit of them here. Okay. We have farms that we're collaborating with. Okay. And so they supply us the herbs. And then... Um, so the the capsules we do them ourselves we do the production um the the, the production of everything because we want to monitor everything we're doing that we can stand for the quality control, of what quality we're putting in the package and you can see from our packages that they are beautiful yes so we beautiful. just yes <laughs> we just want to uh, uh, to appeal to a new set of people the middle class uh the educated people that look you can actually um get you can actually use herbs and they're not crude exactly. they're actually right now do you know that most of the um drugs that we take a lot of people are resistant to them yes. and then they it gets to a point that it doesn't work for certain people and then the side, the, the side effects yeah. oh my god the side Some effects, of the drugs, alone can the side effects are even worse than they're what terrible. the drug is doing exactly so a lot of people actually turning back so even the people in America are coming back to Africa to, ask to for take, herbs. yes, to take the one. Some time ago, somebody called me, um, I was talking to somebody in Iran and said, look, we want to know what you guys, the kind of herbs that you people use. Because everybody was affected by COVID and you were not. So as much what as are you everybody, using? what are you using? <laughs> you know, so um, wow. we need more people to understand that they can sustain their health, not even for illness. Do prevent you can maintain yourself. Yes, yeah. Preventive health. Um, uh, what do you call it now? Don't don't, uh, prevent don't wait till something wait goes till wrong. You can keep your body. Too late then. Health. So just keep on taking the herbs tools and all of that. You just heard directly from the CEO of the Health Factory. She's Reverend Uluwatoni Chayola, and we've been having an amazing time on the TLIG Review Show. All right, thank you guys for being a part of today's show. You know what TLIG Review Show is all about. We bring your brand to the world stage. If you want everybody to know what you do, come to the TLIG Review Show. Thank you guys for being a part of today's show. Remember, every time you participate on all of our shows, you stand a chance to win recharge card for yourself. Thank you. Remember